All right. So what we're looking at here is we've got this um, we've got this sort of a roof. It's sort of an awning. It goes on the back porch here. And uh, I don't know who made this thing or who designed it. I've I don't recall ever seeing one quite like it before. Uh, if I did, I just didn't notice because I wasn't the the poor sap who owned it. Um, we bought this house a few years ago, and when we moved in, um, it, we didn't really notice until right after we moved in that, uh, you know, this gutter was kind of full, um, and it's problematic. Uh, if, if you've never seen one of these before, um, you know, you're probably like most people. Um, if you look, there's just no access to this gutter. Um, you go all the way around, and... Uh, I'm, I'm going to try to get another shot from above in a little while. Uh, there's actually a bedroom window goes out onto the, the other roof up there and we can see it. Um, but if you look, there's really no way to, uh, to access this gutter. And if you, excuse me one second, I'm going to get my tape measure out. If you, if you look there, there's very little space. I mean, less than three inches vertical, um, at the, at the highest point but even then it's it's a really narrow space and then if you look at that that crack that's where the water runs down and uh, i'm going to try to show you from up above in a minute here but um there's really no way you can probably tell already there's really no way to stick your hand down in there or anything and all the gunk is falling down down in there and uh to make matters worse <sighs> let me stick my hand you know there's there's actually a I've got a drop of water in my there's a there's a top right here too so even once you get past this there's still only about a half an inch uh, where you can actually get your hand down in there and so there's you know try to think about what what are you going to get in there what kind of tool is going to be able to reach into that gap to clean that out so i don't know who designed this thing um it's probably a low cost option for you know a, a porch roof uh, that looks a little nicer than maybe some of the alternatives. It would probably have a gutter that's easy to clean. Um, boy, you can, I'm looking at it right now. This thing is really sagging. So uh, we've lived here three years and have never been able to clean this thing. I look at this and I stress out because I just have no idea what the hell to do about it. And I didn't want to dismantle it because that means I have to take the whole roof apart and I, I'm not sure I'd be able to get it back together. Um, and there's just, I could not think of what to do. This whole thing seems to, you know, depend on other parts of itself uh, structurally. So anything that you would try to dismantle, like here, you know, you've got the downspout hole. Um, if you were to, I thought about maybe drilling some holes on the end down here um, to reach in there with something, but I just, everything that I thought about doing, it just seems like if I do that, it's gonna really weaken it structurally. Um, so what I finally came up with is I made a, a little tool. Um, I tried to get up in, in that hole with like a reaching stick. Uh, I thought about trying to use an auger or something, but it just, it, it would just flop around in there, I think. Um, and they make some, some gutter cleaning tools that I found on the internet um, that kind of do this weird like snaky, it's, it's like a little narrow hose piece that can bend um, and you can bend it in like an arc shape and, and that would normally allow you to reach up on a normal gutter. You'd be able to reach up, um, you know, over the top and then point back down and then you could use it to blast out stuff. And I looked at this, but unfortunately the, the arc for it is, is just too broad. It, it wouldn't really get in there very good, I don't think. Um, so uh, after brainstorming a bit, I finally came up with something that I think is going to work. So I'm going to uh, cut to that in a second here. Okay, so here's the top, and uh, it's really clogged up right now. Like, I normally don't let it get this bad. I usually try to get this top very cleaned out. Even though they cleaned out the gap to get in there, you just can't. You can't get back there. You, you, there's not really any good way to get any tool in there that would help you clean this out. Maybe if we could get something under there and scoop up. Um, you know, where, where do you scoop it out through? You can't see the, the openings that are underneath you or anything. So yeah, there's just really no no good way to deal with it. Um, so that's why I made the, uh, the wizard staff deal. 